Um, I'm actually out here doing my pig hunting video at the moment, which isn't doing too well. But what I am finding is a fair bit of uh, natural bush tucker in the place. What I'd like to show you now is this huge tree here. And it's called a Burdekin plum. Uh, it's named from where they come from, I think, where they, I don't know, native to first discovered the Burdekin River up in North Queensland. Um, there's a few growing around Gladi too. If you want to get out and find them, I'm sure they're in other regions. But you can actually get out and find these in parks and things like that. Back when councils used to do a good job and plant trees that you could pick fruit off in the parks, like back when that was a thing, um, you used to be able to find these. I know where there's a couple in Glutz, and I'm not going to tell you where they are. You can go and find them on your own on yourself, and I know people who picked those ones, so I'll see if I can get a fruit down. There's some on the ground here, they've fallen off. Birds get into them. I'm sure the pigs out here are getting into them. Um, I'm not getting into the pigs though. There's a lower one there. Have a look. I'll see them up in the branch. There's plenty of them. That's what it looks like. This one it probably isn't quite right. From what I know, you got to pick them and then let them sit until they start to soften up like a normal plum. So this one's quite firm. Give it a go though. Ah, that is so bitter. Ah. Oh. You can see there's only a little bit of flesh around. I can't get over how bitter that is. Oh, it's just sucking all the moisture out of my mouth. Mmm. I'm gonna have a drink. Oh, that's so bitter, guys. I knew it wasn't right. Oh, that's some relief. But as you can see there, I've bitten into it down to the seed. And uh, not a lot of flesh on them, but pretty good if you cruise around out the bush. You can just find them, have a bit of a feed on them if there's any ripe ones. This one's not. Seems like the kookaburras love them. There's been heaps flying in and out of this tree while I've been here. So whether they eat them or not, I don't know. Whether they eat just things that eat these, who knows. But there you go, guys. Burdekin plum. There's one there. There's another one there. I've actually just parked under them not knowing. So awesome little bit of bush tucker. Hopefully that helps you out next time you're out in the bush. Here's a couple of pictures of the fruit and a few of the trees just off Google so I can give you guys a better look and help you out on trying to identify these trees out in the wild or out in the urban environment. Righto guys, catch you next time.